What is up, my most amazing Media Man fans? This is the Media Man, bringing you once again another reaction for a game I have yet to play. Um, otherwise, it's a review or a let's play. So, this is Die for Valhalla by Monster Couch. So, thank you guys for sending this my way. I did not get paid for it by them, but they did send me the code, so I do want to be honest and upfront with this. I'm going to pick Fall because I like red. That's as good a reason as any, don't you think? Force for good or an agent of evil. So I have a feeling that the Valkyries, there's really no difference between the different colors except for the different colors. Um, I could be wrong. If I find out anything different, I'll let you know in the comments. But I just happen to like red, so... And there you go. I can do a follow-up if you... Follow up. Not a fall up. That'd be interesting. That'd be gravity. Um, not working. But I will do a follow up with this if you guys do want to see if there is any difference or see more of the the action pack levels. So this is those bushes remind me of Charlie Brown for some reason. I'm, I'm not sure. Looks like something a, a kid might draw. But uh, I am digging the art style. I love a good hand drawn. At least hand-drawn looking game, who knows. But it, it certainly looks like that's what the case is. So here we go, here is our Valkyrie. Oh, there you go. And, oh, oh, here I am. I am Kratos. <laughs> I look like a 2D Kratos, I'm just saying. Uh, by the way, if you haven't played the new God of War on the PS4, it is absolutely fantastic. I do have a reaction to the first 30 minutes, but it's a brilliant game. I will try to get back to that at some point if you guys want to see that. Um, but to be honest, at this point, I do not have a PS4. My computer died and I need to get a, uh, a new setup. And my, my pro went a long way to uh, pay for my processor. So, for now, Sony is gone. But uh, I do plan on picking another one up, hopefully. Hopefully by Christmas and all that good stuff. But um, absolutely fantastic system, great games, all that stuff. Just had to make tough choices. But saying that, if you haven't played God of War, I definitely recommend it. It is, like I said, absolutely fantastic. But back to this game, I, I'm digging the art style. Spirit Wolf. Much longer than I thought. That's what she said. Oh. <laughs> Sorry. <clears throat> Let's keep it clean. Spare me, dude. Oh, oh. oh what a cut up. <laughs> yeah. Dude, someone lost his head. Don't lose your head, bro. <sighs> At least I cracked myself up. I know my wife just kind of like rolls her eyes. Just walks away. She's learned to walk away when I make bad jokes. Trapper. I'll probably not walk into the trap. Is it, is it a good call? Oh, no, they're, they're setting me up. Yeah! I like how when you, you hit the bushes, they look like a Charlie Brown tree. You guys seen a Charlie Brown Christmas? He picked out the, the ugliest tree he could find. Probably should avoid being hit by sharp things. Okay. Oh, ow. Ow. Oh, well, good. Yeah, walk into, the <laughs> walk into the next one. I want to show you another character anyway, so... Oh, she's a little harder to control. Maybe because she's more floaty. <laughs> Literally. <clears throat> like disarming it, but I suppose you can disarm the traps. So I'm assuming Archer. Yes, sir. He is a buff Archer. So 
this is a multiplayer game as well, so I'm assuming that he'd be really cool to play um, if you're playing with, you know, at least, a, at least one more person. If not, you know, up to, I think you can do up to four on this game. But generally, ar archers aren't the best for for games that have a lot of close combat stuff. Yeah. So as I was saying. <laughs> There we go. Oh, sword and shield. You have my sword. You have my axe. Oh, that wasn't even close. It was a terrible Lord of the Rings impersonation. Oh. So, just a pro tip if you want to last longer in this game, avoid being hit by spears and swords and things. You're welcome. Okay. Oh, come on. Get the... Get the... See, I don't... Hmm. Not quite sure what those hearts actually did. Am I supposed to stand under them? I don't know. Oh, Trapper got me. She has like a cooldown. Oh. Oh, well, that didn't work out so good for me. I'll be Bach. There we go. Start this shindig over again. So I can die once more for Valhalla. Well, that's a rad helmet. Yeah. <laughs> that's funny. Okay, here we go. We're back. Hopefully I've learned from my mistakes. Okay, so we're going to the sword and shield once more. Kratos grew his hair out. So, because those help me right now, those hearts. Alright. You die. You die, sir. We're gonna have to split up. <laughs> mm. Lots of money, it looks like. Green triangle money. Okay, move. Move, sir. That's right, keep running into my sword punk. Spare dudes have really good range. You want to take them out as quick as you can. It's time for another nap. So obviously, as long as you keep the Valkyrie around, you can just keep going. Just don't let her die. Or go back to Valhalla or whatever it is she does. Yeah. Ha. Oh, that dude's on fire. No, I mean like literally. Uh, you might want to put that out there, sir. Don't, don't touch the fire, is that? Oh, oh, it looks like I'm getting hurt from the fire. Yeah, I, I did. I got hurt. Maybe, maybe move? There we go. There we go. 
So when you're at the Valhalla, or the, I'm sorry, the Valkyrie, it looks like, uh, you should move around a lot when you're fighting. Oh, that's... Female? Viking? Or a dude who likes to wear bikinis? I, I don't know. <laughs> Interesting there. Either way, I'm doing pretty well with her, so... Whatever works, man. Nuggets. What else do you think the nuggets are made of? Hey, it's raining! Money stuff. Oh, I wasn't fast enough. 